Hello guys, how are you? Welcome back to our channel. I'm Alan Chrono from Mr. Chrono. Today, guys, I have some watches I want to show you. Uh, finally, some new Rolexes. So I'm uh, hyped up. I got my three-piece suit on me for these watches. Obviously, for a Rolex, you have to look uh, impeccable. So guys, please tell me at the end your feedback about these watches, if you like them, if you had them before, guys. And uh, let's jump on it and uh, let me show you the watches. So guys, uh, we still have the watches in stock for sale. Our Tudor watches, the Bronze, the GMT and also the Pelagos. I just wanted to put it over here like this. It looks uh, even better. The Black Dial Sky Dweller with the Tudor GMT and the Two Tone Sky Dweller with the Bronze Tudor Black Bay 58. So uh, why do we have and why do we have the honor to have these watches over here? A client of us wants to sell his two watches, the Sky Dweller Two Tone with the yellow gold uh, fruited bezel and yellow gold center links. And the other one, the Sky Dweller with the black dial, but fruited bezel, the bezel it's uh, white gold. But this one, the black dial Sky Dweller, Sky Dweller, sorry. It's simple stainless steel bracelet. Uh, a short history about these two watches, about the Sky Dweller. The first model was first introduced in 2012. Uh, they made it then all only in a gold variation, but uh, now in 2017, they made this one available also in a stainless steel bracelet. The Sky Dweller normally comes with a fruited bezel and Jubilee, but you can buy it if you want from the AD with the Oyster bracelet. This one with a black dial has the watch reference number 326934. Uh, the watch has a case size 42 millimeters. The thickness is 14 millimeters. Uh, lug to lug, it is uh, 50 millimeters. If you can see like this. And also the lug width, it's 20, uh, 22 millimeters. Uh, the watch, it's what 100 meters water resistance. And uh, the movement inside this one, it's a 9001 9, automatic Rolex movement. What I love about this dial, because this one, it's not like the first uh, watches, the gold uh, variation. This one, guys, has the simple hour sticker, like you see it over here. It, it does not have uh, the racing or the Roman uh, letters. It has just the simple classic hour markers and also under the Rolex uh, crown and name you have a red arrow that helps you uh, see the second time zone because this, this watch also has a GMT function uh, and also guys classic Cyclops at 3 o'clock to see the date and very important because this is the Sky Dweller the most complicated movement on a Rolex watch. Under uh, each hour sticker, you will see this red line. So on this watch, on in my hand, because the red it's uh, a two o'clock, that means right now the watch is set to be in uh, February. If the red sticker, for example, will, will be here at five o'clock, under the five o'clock uh, sticker, that means that the month for this watch will be May. Let me show you simple on uh, this one. So because I have two sky dwellers, you can see on this one on two o'clock, that means that the month it's uh, January set for this one. And uh, for this one, the black one, because the red under the red hour marker, it's at five o'clock. That means that the month set on this watch, it's uh, May. Hello guys, so let's uh, set the time on the watch, the elephant in the room. Uh, it's my first time, so be, please be patient with me. So in Oradia, right now in Romania, it's uh, 126 uh, June uh, 18 of the month. So first you have to unscrew the crown. I already did this and please mute the bezel at the first position clockwise. 
the bezel has four positions so because the crown is unscrewed the first thing you can only do is just arm the watch the second position you will see it will do it will not do nothing so let's set first the the time in my uh, country in my city so i've uh, moved the bezel at the second third and fourth the last uh, position of the bezel take the crown to the right so i said uh, 127 so you will see in the middle it's 12 1 you see it's the arrow it's at 1 so right now uh, at my local time zone it's 137 uh, 112 uh, 27 sorry 27 like this Pack simple move it now to the second position again uh, crown to the right and now you will you will move the second time zone in Hungary for example they are with one hour behind that means uh, I will put it at 12 like this uh, so now uh, my local time zone right now here it's uh, 127 and in Hungary it's 1227 uh, after that let's put the crown to the left move it to the third position and now the date uh, the date will to set it and the month the month it's already set but if you go backwards you will see it will go to the other month so uh, going forwards april uh, may sorry may let's go to june exactly so we have the month correctly and now let's set the date uh, i said before 18 15 16 17 18 done and now the first position just simple this is from where we started you will see you will cannot do nothing this is the first position so uh, after you finish it please uh, screw the crown it's done uh, very important with the watch if you want to make the revision for the watch don't go to any uh, watchmaker any local watchmaker because the movement it's very uh, sophisticated i spoke with uh, other dealers around the world normally it's better to do it to uh, to send the watch to your ad if you have patience to wait or uh, to a very good watchmaker uh, well reputed watchmaker in your country not just a simple uh, watchmaker in your city so guys that was it with uh, setting the time on the sky dweller let's go uh, forward so guys after you've seen how you can change the date on the sky dweller i want to put them here uh, for the last time uh, together uh, please not forget the sky dweller has the ring command uh, bezel that was made especially and only for the sky dweller so you can change the date and uh, the time for the watch and also the sky dweller has uh, has uh, patented by rolex the annual calendar named the Sa uh, saros for this watch so guys uh before we are done for today i just want to show you the bracelet it's oyster bracelet it has the brushed outside and uh mirror polished polished in the in the center the simple classic oyster bracelet and what i wanted to tell you and show you that the watch also has the easy link adjustment system for the bracelet you can uh, adjust it if you want five millimeters so right now it's uh, unsized you can wear like this if you want just to adjust it it's simple and it's done now it's five uh, uh, five millimeters tighter on your wrist thank you guys for watching uh, i hope you liked you liked this video i hope you enjoy it 
this was this was also for me my first time uh, seeing trying and also setting a date on the sky dweller i hope now you know how to set the date on the sky dweller if you want to buy one of these watches they are both available on consignment from my client and also guys please not forget uh, the sky dweller with the ring command bezel it has the most complicated uh, mechanism movement from rolex uh, it has that uh, sunburst beautiful dial the one we have it's the black dial and also with the cream dial it's also cost certified it has also five years warranty and if you want to buy one of these watches please send us a message on instagram facebook or on whatsapp Thank you guys again, uh, I hope you have a nice day and please do not forget to subscribe and uh, to hit the notification button and also like this video, it helps us with the YouTube algorithm and guys until next time, please do not forget to wear your watches, see ya!